It's been almost a week now since a Greensboro mother of five was found shot to death in her car. Greensboro police say they found 25 year old Desiree Hall Thursday morning at Hampton Park located on Four Seasons Boulevard. Tonight police are still searching for a suspect. Kirsten Gutierrez sat down with Desiree's older sister. She joins us live now. How's the family doing, Kirsten? Holding up as best they can. Now, Desiree was one of six children, and her oldest sister says she never imagined she'd have to buy her little sister's funeral dress. Her family just wants answers as to why someone would do this. It's having so many plans. And they took my little sister away. From planning for the holidays to planning a funeral, Deja Wilson never thought she'd bury her little sister. I feel like I'm supposed to protect my brother and sisters. This ain't supposed to happen. Greensboro police responded to a suspicious call Thursday morning at Hampton Park. When they arrived, they found Desiree Hall dead from a gunshot wound inside her car. Police still have no suspects. Why? Just why? What what happened at night? Like, and for the most part, turn yourself in definitely. Okay. Unanswered questions lingering for the family as Desiree's sudden death leaves five children ranging from the age of nine to one year old without a mother. And I feel like the one year old would never know her or never remember her. And that really hurt the most. Deja says the last conversation she had with her sister is one she'll never forget. I guess I told her some joke and she was just walking out laughing and smiling. Like, OK, Deja, I'm going to see you. So crazy. And her face just keeps so clear. You see, keeping that image fresh in her mind as she hopes she's in heaven with the father Desiree lost years ago. I know she always talked about her daddy. Mm -hmm. So like my daddy, my daddy, my daddy. So in the back of my head, it's, it's not trying to come clear, but it's like she's happy because she's with her daddy. It's like uh -huh. she's a free soul. Death Ray's funeral is set for this Saturday. Now the family has set up a GoFundMe page to help with the sudden funeral costs. If you'd like to help, you can head to our website, WXI12.com. Live in Greensboro, Kirsten Gutierrez, WXI 12 News.